welcome everyone to another episode of Epic Friday. Well, we're well. I am playing Shadowrun. Uh huh. And Monkey's gonna laugh hysterically at me. Yep. I'm gonna try to fill you in on. You're gonna go with the Dead Man Switch. Sure. Yeah, yeah. So that's like the campaign that comes stock with this game. Okay. Yep. And just for the use at home, I have no idea what I'm in for. I have never played Shadowrun. So I don't the, really know what Shadowrun is. Shadowrun is like a cyberpunk world with magic. Of course. Right. You know. I do like cyberpunk. Uh-huh. Troll is a race? Right. Troll is never a race. No, no. Troll is a race. Not playable. Yep. It is in Shadowrun. Okay. All right. So we've got Street Samurai, uh -huh. Mage, Decker. Yep. Shaman. Yep. Rigor. Uh-huh. Physical Adept. And none. If you click none, you just get to make your own class. Oh, that's super tempting. Right, I know. <laughs> I may get the two symbols mixed up sometimes. <laughs> it's okay, it happens. Oh, what the heck. Right, so one of the things about this being a cyberpunk magic world... It is super cyberpunk. <laughs> right, cyberpunk, and also at the same time as somebody's like hacking into a computer over there. Yeah. Some guy over on the other side of the street is probably using magic to like summon an elemental to like, you know, do okay. something. Of course they are. Right. Can I just... So you click where it says auto? Auto. And then you get to manually change stuff. Okay, but I can't really see it. Yep. <laughs> All right, so this could look stupid. Or it could look awesome. I'm gonna go with both. <laughs> it looks stupid awesome. Yeah, stupid awesome. Uh, maybe what I'm looking for. <laughs> <laughs> maybe. <laughs> I'm gonna go with that. We're gonna see what happens. Oh All god, right. beard. <laughs> oh, there's a ponytail. I yep. do not want the ponytail. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's like a faux hawk. I know. With a big old beard. I know, it's awesome. Doing it. <laughs> Doing it. Horns. Right, if you were a troll, you could have uh, horns. Ah, okay. Yep. I feel for not knowing this game. Uh-huh. This is a bad choice. Well, it, uh, even if you decide you're like, I want to go with one of these other more established classes. Yeah. Um, this will at least get you a chance to like take a look at all the different stats and decide what I want to focus on. Right. All right, continue to stats. Mm-hmm. Continue. Thank it's you. It's okay. Spend your karma. So instead of getting experience, you get karma. And karma is how you level up. Alright, body, quickness, range combat, pistols, SMG, shotguns, rifles, dodge. <laughs> oh, okay, so it's here are the abilities. Yep. And then here's what skills are under said abilities. Right. And something worth noting is skills are limited by the ability. If you only have a quickness ah. one, all of your like quickness related skills yeah. can cap at one. And S can get no better so than that. So I want charisma. Uh-huh. But I have no interest in those. Right, but you might still want like the conversation things. That's that come what out of I charisma. want. I want the I want the conversation things. Yes. So you have to click the plus right there. Yeah. So, you reached a certain milestone in Charisma. What the heck?! <laughs> which allows you to pick an etiquette. So this means you know the etiquette for a certain kind of people and a certain kind of way of doing things. I... Which will give you different dialogue options. I don't... If you're, you know... There's so many... Right, okay, so corporate is yeah. like, you know, the suits and tie kind of folk, right? No, I don't want to deal with them. Security is... I mean, it's, it's security. The security guards. Also... Something worth mentioning about Shadowrun. Yeah. There's not really cops. It's more like <clears throat> private police firms. Okay. That are, like, hired by cities to manage it. That's pretty interesting. And so security fills that role as well. All right. Gangs, obviously the gangs. Yep. Socialite. Uh, socialite, I believe, is for uh, people who mostly go to a lot of parties. Okay. And, like, mingle a lot. I, eh, meh. Shadowrunner? Shadowrunner is like the go-to, like if I don't know which of these I want to pick. I want to Shadow... pick Shadowrunner. Right. What exactly are Shadowrunners? So Shadowrunners are people who take jobs uh, called runs. Yes. And, you know, handle them for their employer. It can be anything from, I don't know, 
going into like getting company secrets, like stealing company secrets. It could be, be cool. It could be a bodyguard job. Okay. It could be just currying one thing from. Got no. it. They're the standard mercenaries. Right. Yeah. We got a job, but we don't want to go through the police because they're jerks. Right. Exactly. Got it. street, obviously, you know, uh-huh. street people. Right. Academics being the smarty, smart people. Right. Okay. Yep. I have no idea. Right, because you don't know. Like, I don't know what any of this is, so I'm just going to go with Shadowrunner because it sure. sounds cool, and I feel that'll be important. Right, and you notice, so you started with 37 karma. Yeah. You bought level 2 in charisma, which took up 2 karma. Yeah. So whatever rank you buy, it costs that much karma. That much to go in. Okay, so I know I want to do... I want to be Talky Talk. Okay. I want biotech. So there's biotech, which is mostly like healing and medkit stuff, like stuff doctors use. Okay. Then you've got decking, which is probably worth noting because decking... Is all about like hacking into the matrix and mainframe of people's companies. I do and stuff. want a lot of hacking. So that's gonna be decking. All right, intelligence. And then decking. Yep, decking. We'll stop at level two for now. Okay. Can you increase these later on? Yes, when you okay. get more karma. Good. So it's not gonna be like. No, no, no. <laughs> so it's not gonna be like in Star Wars. Where, all right, you've increased your ability scores to this. That is it. Right, no. No, you'll be able to increase these later. Yeah. So, all right, I want to be a hacker. Uh huh. Because I like hacking. Yep. I want to do the talky talk. Yes. So I should avoid willpower. Go well, with more charisma. Willpower is also your defense against magic. <laughs> <laughs> Shadowrun loves to make you force, like, Things were like, I'm going to be good in this, but because I'm going to be good in this, I just don't have the points to, like, be competent in something else. Yeah. You will have a failing. You get to decide what that Body? failing is. That's your health. We're just going <laughs> to click on those a bit. Oh, okay. I, I know I want to get... Uh, and then there's a tree under the tree. Right. These are like... Oh, this is like my psychology notes in college. <laughs> uh huh. Dodge, dodge. <laughs> right. I will not be like. Oh, but I need. <laughs> <laughs> and you only have so much karma to spend. I know. So the one thing is, you're playing as a human, is yeah. what you selected. Yep. So humans get an extra like some extra karma to spend. Yeah. But which I've spent. Right. <laughs> uh, the difference is other races tend to get like a natural bonus to some other thing. Okay. Well, that's how it normally is. Right. In every RPG that has ever RPG'd. Yeah. Um, it's always human is like you know we're good at everything, uh -huh. but we can't. It'll be hard to master one thing. Right. Right. Whereas certain races. You just have a natural disposition to one thing. Yeah. Yep. All right. Got it. And then there's ESP control. What's ESP control? So it's under intelligence. It's right under the decking. It's like a subset of decking. So you've got decking and then yep. ESP. ESPs are, uh, I forget what it stands for, but it's like export a system. Yep. Export system programs. So okay. special programs you use in the Matrix. Basically, if you want to use the special <sighs> nice stuff in the Matrix when you're hacking, you're going to want that. You're a horrible person. Yep. <laughs> and don't forget, you still haven't got any skills in any weapon. Uh, <laughs> you just reverted everything. I know. <laughs> all right. But, all right. I'm going to want some health. Yeah. It's going to be important. Yep. I do want to be guns. Okay. And le oh, but I want the sword. Uh huh. Mm. <laughs> They're two very different trees. I know. No. Nope. So I want the samurai sword. Uh huh. I like the katana. Right. But rifles are awesome. Yes. Rifles are awesome. So all right, this is what I'm gonna do. Okay. I'm gonna do quickness. Uh huh. Strength. Yep. And decking. Okay. And the rest, oh, but the talky. Uh huh. But the story and the talky. But this is all text based. Uh huh. So. 
screw no, it. No, I mean, conversations are a big thing, though. I know. I'm thinking for the video. Okay. Um, this game is horrible. <laughs> I know. I love it so much. <laughs> It's great at forcing you to, like, pick and choose stuff. I know. I know. Close combat? Oh, you have to get close combat before you can even get it. Correct. Ah! <laughs> yup. Melee weapon? No, we're gonna do melee weapons. Okay. Alright, that's fine. Yep. So we got strength. Yep. Got intelligence for the decking. Uh-huh. Alright. Quickness. Yep. Which means range combat. Uh-huh. Which then means rifle. Yeah. What? Just just click the plus ones. There you go. Okay. What do you do? Critical damage percentage visible. Right. So you won't. You don't even know what your crit chance is without that. Also, that gives you the burst fire option. I hate you. Oh. <laughs> uh, uh huh. All right, so now you can at least see what your crit damage chance is. Yeah, well, probably nothing. <laughs> Strength, blah, blah, blah. Uh -huh. All right, we're going to spend the rest in charisma. Okay. Shadow runners. Yep. Because you guys are awesome. Uh-huh. Spirit, no. <laughs> mm, I mean... <laughs> it's important. Right. Do you want to be able to defend yourself against magic? Yeah, it might be important. <laughs> Well, there you go. You have one karma left. I know. Dodge. <laughs> Always a good choice. All right. So there's the character. All right. This will be interesting. Pretty well-rounded. A name. Right. And this isn't like your name name. This is like your street name, your handle, what people call you. Okay. When they're looking for someone to do a job. Got it. I'll do my, uh, my gamer tag. All right. There you go. Those of you with an Xbox One, feel free to add Y as Wolf as spelled on the screen. I'll give you uh, two seconds to see that. Uh -huh. <laughs> Especially since the mouse is not working for me, so I didn't give you a choice. Yeah. Well, you know, there you go. Yeah. So there's, you know, like almost 15 minutes I'm just creating <laughs> a character that I don't know what he looks like. Right. Well, remember, no, you, you gave him like a faux hawk and a beard, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got a big white bushy <laughs> beard and a big white faux hawk. Yeah, he does. Although I do like for almost every character I play, I always give them silver or white hair. Mm -hmm. Up there is the story, by the way. It was on the loading screen. This is straight up Fallout. <laughs> yes, like traditional. This Fallout. is like Fallout One. Right. If you ever played the original, or I like, cannot read that. Um, a slip of paper with your bank. Something, something. Something about bank account. Yep. All right. I think it was basically saying like, hey, here's your bank account, and here's how much you have in it. It's nothing. Yeah. You have nothing. Oh, okay. I can zoom in a bit. Yep. You know, which helps. Yes. Uh, can you rotate? Uh, nope. Definitely not. All right. <laughs> you know, viewers, I'm sorry for this, but you're going to hear some clicky clicks yep. really well because there's no other way to do this. All right. A bathroom, got the does alright. Gonna go Ah, okay. There might be something else in the room to look for. There might be. There's a lot of like examining your surroundings in this. Alright, uh your bank account enough for you to do something. Okay. It'll cover you through the end of the week. Alright. And so that's all you got. So basically So you'll see those like little magnifying glass symbols that pop up sometimes. Yeah, when I go over something. Right, and then there's a couple oh, there's of there's one right there. Yep. Your computer. Okay. State of the art in 2050. All right, well, now I know we're in 2050. Right, but, you know, it's like 200 and... Oh, Ooh. 2111 or something. View your contact list, view your personal calendar, put down your notebook. All right, let's view the contact list. Carter, Drode, something... New Larry? Yeah, new Larry. As opposed to old Larry. Right. And there's half Jack. Uh-huh. As opposed to full Jack. Yeah, you know. All right. Yeah. View yeah. personal calendar. You've got a lot of friends who are probably dead right now. Okay. Of 
course I do. Yeah. All right, so I looked at that. Oh, your vid phone rings, jarring you. Who's calling at 3 a.m.? Seriously, who calls me at 3 a.m.? Right. Also, there's this thing. So okay. There's your quest, objectives and mission items. Yep. Then at the bottom of that, you have uh, your character. So when you get... I can't even know what I look like! That, that was the portrait you chose. Uh. <laughs> so when you get more karma, that's where you spend it. Okay. There's your gear. That's not a rifle. That's a rifle. Actually, that's an SMG. No, is it? Yeah, it's a submachine gun. Okay. Well, hey, that's what my character looks like. Right. Yeah, yeah, that's what you look like. That's not so bad. And then cyberware, do you have a deck? You have a data jack, but you don't have a deck. Okay. So you can't hack into anything yet. Uh, this is where we save and do stuff. Yep, there's all that. Also, at the top, it says you have zero new yen. Create new save. Yeah. Zero new yen? As opposed to old yen? Yeah. So do I click that one? That, that'll that bring up your, uh, your big thing. That, that whole, like, panel you were looking through. Okay. Because that's your, like, PDA or whatever. That, I was just making sure. It's a big off button. Right, yeah, to yeah. To me. Yeah. So I don't want it to be, like, off. All right, game save, shut down. <laughs> yeah, no, that's how you pull out your, like, PDA or whatever. Okay. Yep. Answer your vid phone. Yep. Your apartment, 3 o'clock in the morning. Just got four. Well, oh, I hope so. Running the shadows is all about feast or famine. Yep. All right. Yeah. That's very uh, steampunk. Yep. Or, well, cyberpunk. Right. You're either going to have so much money you can live like a king, or you're going to live in squalor kind of like you are. Yeah, which is what I'm doing. Yep. Also, there's where any of your other cybernetic augmentations would go. All right. I can dig it. Yeah. Now, how do I answer this phone? Well, if you close your PDA, you might look for a phone. There's a, a yellow marker now. Do you see it? It's a little hard to see. It's on one of the desks. Uh, I can yep. barely see it. Yep, there it is. Hey, Sam Watts. The screen leaps to life, making you squint against its brightness. The face on the screen is laughing. Sam Watts. Hey, buddy. Hope he didn't catch you at a bad time. He giggles. He's drunk again. Or worse. Or worse. Oh, got it. You're zoned. Screw high! <laughs> You're zoned. Right. Another giggle. Oh, don't bother with your side of the conversation. I'm not really here. Okay. Just one reason of this vid, someone finally geeked? Yep, geeked. Geeked me, I'm dead. I pro- okay, he's dead. Right. What? <laughs> but he's on the phone. <laughs> shh, shh. <laughs> I did <laughs> Ah! <laughs> when you're an unsavory character like me, you tend to associate with other unsavory characters who often uh, partake in unsavory business, like you, for example. So why am I dead? Who knows? Probably my fault. <laughs> All right. Something. Wondering what he did. Some of us are born. Blah 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 blah. Now he's reminiscing. Yeah. Doubt. That's a name you haven't heard in a long time. Really? I just read it in a book over there. <laughs> like three seconds ago. <laughs> right. Three okay. years ago. A makeshift bar in... Oh, Seattle! Right. The night Dowd went down. Oh. New Larry. Hey, New Larry. Where's old Larry? Well, New Larry's... I mean, old Larry's probably dead. Alright. So, let's... yeah. Yep, you got it. There we go. Okay, hey. Sengoma. You have weird teeth. Sengoma is an urban shaman who proved her worth during a run against Fuchi last fall. She's the quiet type, an experienced runner. Alright. We're out in the open here. Well, duh. Uh, our fixer owes us the run, and dude, we wait. Fixers are the guys who set you up with jobs. Got it. They, uh, they fix you up. It's like you're a fixer. All yeah. right. Something important to know: fixers do not f repair your items. They they only give you jobs. Yes. <laughs> that makes sense. New Larry, you've been running with New Larry for about six months now. He's a combat mage with a bad tattoo and a bad attitude. He knew Dowd almost as well as you did. 
never saw any, uh, da- never saw anybody die like that before. He shakes his head. I hate this city. It's wet. Rain feels like acid. I want out of here. Shut your screamer. Screamer. Okay. We wait for the money. I got it. Now take a pill and relax. All right. <laughs> Definitely cyberpunk. We wait. Yep. Yeah, sure, of course. I'll wait all night if I have to. Uh, oh, yeah, you're not dead yet. Nope, this is three years ago. <sighs> you guys were doing a job together. Yeah. On the docks of Seattle. All right. Uh, what do you think we should do? It'll smell funny to you. All right. And it smells funny to him. Yep. Public place. Cut the drick, Sam. We both know why Dad went down, and it wasn't the fixer of some other paranoid chip dream of yours. Chip dream? Right, so, yes, there is alcohol, and of course that and drugs are things people get high on. But there's also chips you can, like, hook up into your brain so you can experience, like, through your nervous system, what someone else experiences or has experienced. Okay. So chip dreams are, like, when you get, like... like you slot in a uh, uh, a chip that has like the neurological memory of another experience. Got it. That's weird. Right. It's a dangerous thing. Is yeah, that sounds very dangerous. But I mean, it like yeah. Yep. All right. Yeah. You know. It's like that newfangled brain drug. Got it. Thing. Yeah. Like you do. Alright, well we got sold out by Larry. Yep, new Larry. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. New Larry. Because <laughs> that's a big difference. <laughs> he relaxes and throws you a Drek-eating grin. Drek? Um, like... Feces. Got it. Yep. You know. They got slang for everything. Like you do. Yeah. Alright. Now you're getting your combat tutorial. Yeah, combat tutorial. Yeah. Oh, you shot him. Yep. Wow, this is so much like old school Fallout. Right. Yeah, yeah. Heck yeah, show help. Oh, God. Right. So there's a lot of things in this. Alright, left button, select, move character, right button, click and hold, pan camera. Uh huh. Zoom in and out. Got yep. it. Yeah. Cameras. Free, locked, auto. Got it. Uh huh. So you have so many AP or action points. Yeah. You can use in a turn. You yeah. can use that to move, you can use that to shoot. All sorts of stuff. Got it. And we got the HUD. Yep. Which, you know, standard HUD things. Right. Combat. Uh huh. Heavy leading on light, standard things, party members, okay. Day damage, target, fire, okay. Yep. More combat. Oh! Like Valkyria Chronicles and XCOM. Uh huh. Spellcasting, Karma, Cyber Wave. Alright, I think yeah. we can figure this out. Yeah. Get a job. Get any job. Right. Okay. Yep. Got it. So I want to get. Oh, there's a bad guy. Yeah, there's a bad guy right there. New Larry. I'm gonna shoot him. All right, you hit him twice. Shoot him again. You hit him twice more. All right, you. He is resistant to dying. Of course he is. He is now dead. All right, I want you to move there for cover. Uh huh. Sweet, I don't have to do anything. I just have to click for cover. Right. Yep. That's it. Nice. Yeah. And there you go. Alright, this isn't so hard. Right. It's pretty good. I probably should have moved to cover. Right, probably. Now they're all shooting at you. Yeah, but they missed, so... Thankfully, they missed. Alright. Oh, okay. Yeah. Big over two turns. Uh-huh. Uh, we could get super flanked there. Right. Try- well, I think this turn I should probably move there. Uh-huh. Shoot that guy. Sure. And then next turn, try to flank the guy. Yeah, yeah, no, that sounds good. And we shoot. Nice, you hit him once. So, Shoot him again. This game also has, like, reverse crits. 
What? So you get crits where you do damage. What do you mean reverse crits? You have crits where you do like double damage or 1.5 times damage. Okay. And then you also have what I call reverse crits, which are like weak hits where you do half damage. Oh, okay. So it's uh, effective, super effective, not effective. Right. It's Pokemon. Well, sometimes like it just happens on a roll. Like you hit, but you only got you only get to do half damage. Got it. Okay. Yeah. So that's a thing that happens. Got it. Uh, I want you to kind of stay there. Uh huh. So how do I? Where's? Where's? Okay. All right. So you can click that bullet symbol, and that's her different firing options with that. Got gun. it. Aim shot or just shoot it. Right. Do aim shot. Uh huh. Which probably takes some turns. Uh, it just no. It takes up just one action. Oh, okay, but three parts of that action. It takes three turns before that's off cooldown. Got it. So she can use it once again so after three more turns. Stay there. And you can just on. you can just click oh, end. end. I didn't see that. Yep. So those of you at home, we're using a TV for this. That is about ten feet away. <laughs> and so I can't see half of this. Right. All right. So we're. Oh, you have no. Well, the reason why it says no covered. Well, I mean, yes, also that table doesn't provide you much cover. Yeah. But also because you'd be exposed on your back because there's still a guy to the left. I am aware. I'm uh -huh. trying to get to that guy. Right. So I feel I should move there. You might have a grenade. I do have a grenade. If you cycle through, uh, go more to the left, to the left of your damage indicators of your gun. Got it. There's a little arrow. Yep. You can cycle through your gear. Heck yeah. You do not have a grenade. I do not have a grenade. I have pistols. Yep. You have a pistol and a submachine gun. All right. Well, we're going to go... There's no way. Uh, I mean, you fire twice. Nope. <laughs> yep. Maybe. I mean, this guy could just get right up on him. Right. Yeah. Just, you know, pop him. All right. Get right up on him, buddy. Mm-hmm. Pop him. He almost popped him. Oh. <laughs> right. All right. I mean, that could turn out very poorly. This is going to turn out very poorly overall. Uh-huh. So, let's move there. Uh-huh. And then shoot that guy. Nice. Yeah. Nice. That was a good shot. Yeah, yeah, that was a crit. Got double damage. Ah, uh, you missed. Good for him. <laughs> That's a big dude. Right, that is a big dude. He might be a troll. <laughs> oh, they shot Sangoma. They shot Sangoma again. Could you stop? And that was magic. Stop it. <laughs> For the love of all that is holy. Oh. <laughs> he just summoned a demon. <laughs> he did summon a demon. I don't like this anymore. Can I just leave? Uh, I don't think so. You sure? I Pretty mean... sure. Pretty sure. So now you're out of ammo. So you can click on your submachine gun down there to reload it for one action. Of course. Yup. Because, oh god. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna move him there. Uh huh. That's probably not a bad idea. Yay! Kill you dropped that him. guy. Uh huh. You need to. Oh god. Yep. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> so many bad things everywhere. So many bad things everywhere. You mm -hmm. should. You should probably die. You definitely need to die, but you're all the way over there. Right. So, let's shoot you. Uh-huh. Ooh, that was pretty good. That was like a half crit. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, you dropped you're dead. it. Oh. Then there's these guys again. Yeah. Well, thankfully, they missed. Hooray! Oh, God. Then there's that guy. Why does the AP go up? So, the way how summons work in this game... Wow, they suck. ...is you, the summoner can choose to, like, push the thing to get like, in theory, he could just give it like seven actions if he oh, wanted to. I do not like that. But the problem is there's a higher chance it will rebel Oh. the more actions you give it. That's interesting. Because the more freedom you give it, the more chance it's just gonna take that freedom and run. And just be like, well, forget you. Right, exactly. Oh, he has spray and pray. Oh, cool. Neat. You might not have enough ammo for it. You can click it to like, I mean, oh no, he's still got enough ammo for it. Yeah. Kill that thing. Now he's out of ammo. We're gonna reload for an action. Okay. 
Hey, Soma. Uh-huh. You're gonna move there. Uh -huh. So you actually have... Cover. Yay! Nice. I like you, uh, Soma. This is actually going, you know... This is better than, definitely a lot better than I thought it was. <laughs> right. Like, you're not dead. So that's good. And not being dead is half the battle. Right. Some would say it is the battle. <laughs> <laughs> I would say them being dead is the other part of the battle. Uh-huh. Oh, I can switch who takes her turn when. Right. Yep, exactly. Oh, heck! So if you just want to do that and then, like, give an opportunity for somebody else to maneuver up, that's totally something you can do. Or shoot that guy. <laughs> nope. That guy can wait. We're going to switch to spray and pray. Uh-huh. And then we're going to move... There? There? No, there. Yeah, that's a pretty good spot. We're gonna move there. Uh huh. And we're gonna blast that guy. Nice. Got him twice, but they were uh, yeah, they were weak crits. We're gonna go uh, hang out with Soma. Oh no, you're screwed. Oh, oh, he might drop. Well, oh wow, they're they're distributing the pain relatively evenly. That's not smart. Yeah. I mean, otherwise, both of your companions could be dead right now. Yeah. Murderize him. Oh, okay, fine. I mean, shoot him again, shoot him again, shoot him again. Yeah! yeah. Sangoma lowers her gun and eyes Sam. You okay, Sam? Sam's breathing is heavy, and he looks shaken. Of course he does. That was an interesting thing. Uh-huh. Uh, you did good. You don't look so good. Uh, uh, you don't look so good. You were born for this good, Wise Wolf. <laughs> Me, not so much. I think I'm gonna hang it up. Uh, okay. Stay drunk. Uh, okay, got it. Yep. Of course. Right. You know. Oh, snap. Uh huh. Right, you can play the jerk in this game if you want to. Uh huh. I'll find a safe house. <laughs> yeah. 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 So remember that good time? Good times. Good times back then. Good times. Yep. <laughs> wow. You stare at Sam's face on your comm link. Shake off the memory. Focus. Focus. And we're going to focus next episode. And we're going to continue this series for, I feel, a while. <laughs> <laughs> Possibly. All right. Well, we will see you all next time. Bye. Bye.